So May is Volcano Awareness Month in Washington, and we're going to start it off by erupting a volcano. All right, so in Washington, we have five active volcanoes. Um, all of them aren't currently erupting, but they can at any time. So we're going to talk about what would make them erupt. They're all in a state of just add magma right now, which means when that magma moves in, it could cause them to erupt. And the key to that is gas. There's these gas bubbles in there. It's mostly water. And as those expand, as they get near the surface, they're going to push that magma and turn it into lava and push everything else out of the way. So today we're going to simulate that with not with water vapor, but with the gases we create in a small chemical reaction involving baking soda and vinegar. You might have done this yourself. Um, we have this beautiful volcano, got some nice red on it. It could be any of our volcanoes. Which one do we think it looks like? I think Baker or... Looks like Mount Baker or Colshan. So uh, yeah, let's see what happens when this erupts. And we've already got some baking soda in there. Um, I am going to put a cap on afterwards just so you can see how that pressure would actually cause, um, would actually push a cap out of the way. So here we go. And here comes the gas and it pushed that right out of the way. Oh, look at that go. It's a reminder that when your volcano is erupting, it is time to follow your volcano evacuation route to safety, usually high ground. but. Right now, while it's not erupting, is the best time to do that. Best time to find that alert or find that evacuation route and learn where that is so you know what to do when the volcano is erupting ahead of time. Thanks for joining us and have a fantastic Volcano Awareness Month.